Yeah, day people. Hope you're having a great day today. All right, uh, what we're doing today is I'm going to do a uh, map and mod order video how to. And uh, I've got uh, two different sort of map setups here to show you today and uh, mod order. Uh, the first one is the uh, standard one that I, I call standard, uh, where I've got the Canadian map and the uh, Alaska map and reformer maps uh, on the first one. And then the second one that we'll do is the, um, well, I suppose it's called the GMC or Great American map combo. And that has quite a few different maps, and I won't go into that until I actually start it, and I'll show you the, all the maps that are on there. So anyway, we'll start with the um, first one, which is, again, like I say, Alaska, Mexico, and Canada add-ons. And uh, that's in this profile that I've got, the Classic XL, which is one of the trucks that I've already featured. And we'll jump in and show you uh, exactly how I've got that set up. And uh, this map order and mod order is the order that I've found works best and uh, there's no uh, conflicts with it. Um, there's something like, I think I've got around about 70 or 80 um, mods on this profile alone. So you, you'd, um, you can see that to get them to work in unison is um, not always the easiest. So I stick to a sort of uh, a pattern. Uh, in what I do when I add a mod, it falls into a category, and those categories are all laid out in the active mod section down here. So we'll start, I always start down the bottom because uh, the way I look at it is your maps are your foundation, and anything that you lay on top of that um, should be laid in order of how it falls onto the map. So starting with uh, the maps, I've got the Alaska North to the Future. That's a paid uh, map, and uh, it adds the uh, Purdue Bay through to, oh, I've forgotten where it goes, but it, it basically gives you all of uh, Alaska. Then we've got uh, your Reformer. What we'll do is go up here and show you the maps. And do, 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 do. where are we? Status. Wrong way. Other way. Okay. So we've got the Pro Mods, Canada. We've got the Reformer, which gives you Mexico. I've also got a Frankenstyle uh, garage, depot, whatever you want to call it. Oh, that's right. I've also got the Montana uh, expansion, uh, the Coast to Coast and uh, Midwest expansion. So what we'll do is we'll go through that. So yeah, so in order, I drop in Alaska first. Uh, why? I, basically because I found that's the way it works best. And with your reformer, I go with mega resources, uh, the reformer map itself, which is the uh, 2.5.4147 which works with the uh, latest update, the 147. Next, followed by the Coast to Coast. Uh, then the Midwest expansion. Then your Man Montana expansions. Gives you the uh, farm ranch build as well. Uh, then the map edit for Denver, the uh, garage there. And then the compatibilities patch for the other maps. So that goes on top because it's like a, a def file, and uh, it looks after all these ones because they're other maps. Uh, the Pro Mods is a separate to, to, to these, as it's a, um, because of the, the, the size of the package. So Pro Mod, Pro Mod oh, tongue-tied tongue again today. Pro Mods Canada Assets, Pro Mods Canada Models, Pro Mods Canada Map Pack, pack and then Pro Mods Canada Definition Pack. So this is this takes care of all of the Canada gear on the map. Now you can pause this video at any time to see the order. So going back down here, 
you can pause and see where we are. Drag that down. Pro Mods Canada. Then this is a um, an add-on to connect Alaska to Canada. So it's called the Alaska North to the Future to Pro Mods Canada RC. And uh, that just takes care of connecting Canada to the Alaska. Then we have here the Reformer and Pro Mods background fix. And what that's for is to join Pro Mods and Reformer onto the normal map of the game. And that takes care of um, the background so that it doesn't overlap and you haven't got uh, towns and cities floating around in the Pacific or whatever, in the oceans. Then you, uh, after you've got your maps, you drop in your trucks. In this one, of course, we've got the classic XL. And uh, as far as the order of that goes, you can find out what that is uh, once you pour, uh, purchase the John Ruder map. But uh, hence to say again, you can pause it and check out the, uh, the order here. Um, and this is the order that John Ruder suggests that you drop them in. So again, maps first, then your trucks. Then your trailers, I've dropped a skin in here. Normally I'd say put your skins at the end of your trailers, uh, but I've dropped it in there because it's all the classic stuff, classic XL. And this is the uh, pure elegant skin for um, Ruder trucks. So I've dropped that in there. So again, maps, trucks, then your, your trailers. So again, this is all the stuff that gets your maps are your foundation. Your trucks are then driving on that foundation, so your trailers. Okay, and then once you pass your trailers, I drop in skins. So any skins for uh, trailers or uh, trucks, I would normally drop in this area. So maps, trucks, trailers, skins. Then uh, from there, I go into the cargo. So it, and as you can see, anything to do with the trailers is dropped in here too. And in, after that goes the cargo um, mods. So as you can see, I've got the military cargo from Jazzy Cats and I've got the case Axel, Axial Flow 230 series. Then we go into our um, um, tuning parts. Okay, if you've got AI traffic as well, you could drop that in here somewhere. So all your um, tuning parts, wheels, tires, rims, and then your AI traffic. Uh, then after that, we're looking at any of your sort of other um, mods that you're using, like lights um, and, and stuff similar to that. And then here we have um, any of the, uh, like I say, the, the UI or other. And then you drop here into your physics. And then uh, graphics. So you've got your yellow lights, chase camera, the rat, rat advisor, realistic mirrors, and so forth. Once you pass that, again, this is all your graphic sort of stuff, as you can see. Then we get into the sounds. And that's where I've got all the engine sounds and so forth in that, uh, that order. So you can see I've got quite a lot of um, engine sounds. And then on top of the engine sounds, we've got the rest of the sounds, the GPS, the Morgan Freeman, real AI traffic uh, sounds, improved sounds, and then the sound fixes is on top because that covers the lot. Uh, and that, that basically fixes any problems that you've got with these sounds. It's a great mod, this one. And then uh, finally on top of that, I've got the ATS satellite background for North and Central America. And you'll see that in a tick. I'll jump into the game and show you what it looks like. So again, we'll just quickly run through it. So it's maps first. Trucks, trailers, skins, cargo, AI traffic, tuning and interiors, UI and other, physics, graphics, sound, and then your background map at the top. And we'll uh, have a look at that.
And again, this is works for me, and this is yeah, 93 mods in this one. And uh, I'll jump into the game, and I'll be right back. Okay, so here we are. We're loading into the game now. And uh, I'll show you the exact map and how it, uh, what it looks like once you've got all the mods and maps in order. Okay, and there's the truck. So we'll uh, go to the world map. Yeah, and as you can see, you've, we've got the... Uh, whoops, take that off of there. We've got the uh, satellite background, which looks pretty snazzy. And this is Mexico. This is all um, added through the Reformer bundle. As you can see, that adds quite a bit. And then we've got uh, the coast-to-coast -coast section. Then you've got uh, Montana. Where's Montana? Up here somewhere. Mile City around here. Yeah, Great Falls, that's Montana. And then up through here, this is Canada. Around, or part of Canada. They're still working on the rest of it. But that, uh, that'll all be updated soon. This is the um, connect connecting road. It goes from Canada through to uh, Alaska, and this is the Alaskan mod from Purdue or P Prudhoe Bay. Oh, and they take speaking lessons uh, through the Fox River, etc., in uh, Alaska. So you can see it adds quite a bit of um, territory to the map. And like I say, they're expanding on Canada all the time, and I'm guessing the guys that are doing Alaska are doing the same with that as well and there's uh, always updates to the coast to coast and to the uh the mexico section so it keeps uh keeps the interest in the game as well but uh so yeah so that's that one now what we'll do is we'll hop back out of this and i'll show you the huge combo that i've got on the uh the next profile be right back. All right, so the next combo I've got on the Black Beauty, which is one of the trucks that I'll feature in my show trucks. In fact, it'll probably be the next uh, episode, episode five, I think it is. It's called the uh, Black Beauty. So we'll go in here and we'll have a look at these maps. And again, keeping in mind with the order that I use, and I'll run through that again. And what I'll also do is I'll leave it... Uh, the order in the description below. Oh, what have we got here? That's weird. What's happened there? Why is that uh, not on there? It's been deleted for some reason. All right, well, we'll take that out of there. And uh, I'll find out what happened there later. Anyway. Okay, so um, back to, like I say, remember the order, maps first, uh, then your trucks, trailers, skins, cargo, AI traffic, turning, uh, tuning, interiors, UI other, physics, graphics, sound, background map. Now that's going from the bottom up. Because again, like I say, I use the maps as the base. So... Again, Alaska at the bottom. Then out of this, I'll leave a link to this package, this combo package in the description below so you'll be able to download all these. I won't need to give you an individual for each one. Uh, there's a, a link to where you can get, you know, that shows you all the maps that are involved in this. So Alaska, light urban overhaul, mega resources again, the reformer map itself. MUO, Reform of Compatibility Patch. Uh, then your Pacific Map Models, Pacific Map DEF, Los Angeles Cruise Terminal, MUI Reformer, LA Ferry Patch, your Hawaii Ferry Mix, a uh, fix, <laughs> Ferry Mix, uh, Remove Washington Ferries, then the Great America Map. Uh, the Mega Resources Great America patch for this map. Then you drop in your coast to coast. 
your Midwest expansion, Montana, uh, the map edit, compatibilities, your uh, pro mods, and this one I've put in the Alaska uh, North to the Future No Ferry, uh, so you can uh, drive rather than using the ferry, and then the uh, Pro Mods Canada uh, North to the Future connection, road connection. The background again, background fix. So that's all the maps in that um, section. And again, this adds a lot of uh, extra ground to cover in your in your um, your maps. So yeah, so your maps, trucks, trailers. Once you've gone through your trailers, then you go into your skins. Once you've done your skins, into your cargo, and it's the same again as we did with the other one from here on and all the way to top and the difference is once you pass your sound the difference with this one is you use the pro mod specific and north america background map instead of the satellite map because the satellite map won't work on it because you have such an expanse of uh territory to cover and the uh, the satellite map unfortunately doesn't cover all that territory. Anyway, I'll show you what I mean. So just remember that if you're using the Great American combination, don't use the satellite background because it won't work. You need to replace it with this one, the Pro Mods Pacific and North America background map. And also don't use the full page map mod, which a lot of people use, because that um, although although it works, if you once you try to zoom in on the map it'll freeze and crash the game. Or well, that's what i found anyway, so I don't use that at all anymore. I used to use it, but not anymore because it's crashing the game. So remember, do not use the satellite map on the uh, Great American Expansion map or whatever it's called. Uh, just use this, and that way you'll have no problems. Okay, so we'll hop into the game, and I'll show you what that looks like. Okay, so uh, here we are, back in uh, the game. This is a truck that I'll be uh, I'll be featuring in the next uh, show truck video. But for now, we'll uh, check out the world map and what we've got added to this. Okay, so as uh, the other section, other uh, profile, we've got. Canada, and we've got Alaska, but we also have down here, bear with me, just follow the dotted line, we have Honolulu, Hawaii, we also have way over here, bear with me, there it is, Koror, <laughs> whatever that is. Uh, I've done a slight, uh, uh, I've done one job on there just to check it out. Uh, it's quite a good little uh, map. It is only small, but uh, the design and the, the, the layout and the graphics are fantastic. And I've only passed through, bear with me, Honolulu. I haven't actually done any jobs on there yet. Jeez, zoom out. Takes a while to get that. There it is there. And uh, that's Hawaii. Then you've got the ferry terminals and whatnot down here that uh, connect you to those two places on the map. And again, you've got Mexico all the way down here. You've got your coast to coast. Plus you've got a, a hell of a lot more throughout America here, more uh, uh, in-depth road that I haven't travelled yet, uh, more uh, places to visit, um, just yeah, just incredible amount of uh, territory to cover. And again, like I say, you can't use the satellite map because 
it doesn't go all the way to Honolulu and so forth, and the game will crash if you uh, use the satellite map and also if you use the uh, full screen map on either of them, it will it will crash. So anyway, as you can see, you get uh, quite a lot of um, extra mileage uh, and places to get to visit by having these uh, the combos put in place. So this it's been a quick and dirty um, look at how to do this, but again, we'll just um, I'll just say to you: remember uh, that the order that it goes in is your maps, trucks, trailers, skins, cargo, AO traffic, tuning, interiors, and. Uh, UI, other, physics, graphics, sounds, and then your background map. And again, that's all going from the base up. So what I'll do is I'll leave that um, list or order in the uh, description below so that you can uh, copy and paste that into whatever so that you've always got it for reference. Uh, but this is what works for me. I don't necessarily say that it's definitely going to work for everybody but uh with me it works fine and as you can see um i've got just under 100 mods in this profile alone and other profiles i've got about 120 and i don't get any conflicts so uh you can see it works and i think those two uh, maps that were missing and when we first came in here that were red I think that was because I recently updated two of them and forgot to take out the old ones. So I'll have to check that later anyway. So, yeah. So, uh, again, don't forget to have a look down below in the description for information on where to get these uh, maps and also the combination that you can put it in, the order that you put the maps and the mods in. That'll all be down below in the description. And if you found this useful, uh, press the like button. Share the video so uh, others can have a look too. And if you haven't already subscribed, do that. Also, don't forget that um, I've got a giveaway happening at the moment. So if uh, I'll leave a link to that in the description below as well. So have a look at that. Uh, you never know, you might be lucky and win one of the prizes. So thanks for watching, guys. I hope this was useful to you. Um, like I say, it was just a quick, simple explanation. Didn't go into any of the technical detail. Just a quick uh, order of the maps and the mods for you to look at. And uh, if you enjoyed it, I hope to see you on the next one. So bye for now.